opens the bathroom door and you'll see that paint is missing right there. That's because last night I walked up to it and there was a little bubble in the paint and I picked it and it just came off like it was uh, nothing. And it's because uh, oil-based paint was um, added to latex paint and it doesn't stick. So I'm going to peel this off. Uh, when Kevin gets home, he will remove this from the front and maybe even these pieces. We will keep this piece on because it looks good. But as you can see, something dripped there from this where it was painted in place. See, this is how this peels off. You can just get a piece and it, it will come right off. And it, it won't do that if you prime it first. See that? It should not do that. Okay, we brought the door out back and Kevin is going to take the knob off first and the plate because we bought a new one and we're going to put that on and then he's also going to sand the door so everything's flat so that we can repaint. I was going to, we thought about leaving the wood like it was but it, it will make the hallway really dark and there's uh, three other doors uh, and they would need to be refinished and they would be just as dark it would make it the hallway really dark so we're just going to repaint to keep it bright I will get a plastic bag and put those in this is garbage. It's all bent up. Okay, Kevin is filling in these little holes with wood putty because this plate is smaller than the one that was on here before. So we have to cover in the holes. Okay, I have started priming the door, and it looks really ugly when you prime, and you can see through it, and um, it just looks like it's going to be terrible, but then once you paint, you'll cover all this up, and you won't even know that it's there. But this will help the paint to uh, be darker and uh, stick just better. Stick to the old paint. This is the door after the primer has dried. And I have gone over it with the white on the edge and up at the top. And you can tell that it's, it's covering that primer right up, covering that door up. So it doesn't have to look perfect once you're finished with the primer. But now I'm going to uh, finish with the white paint. Okay, I've finished with one coat and now I'm starting to put my second coat on. And then I will be finished. Okay, it's been a few hours and the door is dry and now Kevin is going to put the plate 
on the door. We won these off of eBay, and it's hard to see the detail there. You can see this one. It's a different shape than the doorknobs, uh, the plates that were there before. But we don't mind this having a different plate since it's on the on the bathroom door. This is what the doorknob looked like before. I, this is a door in the kitchen, but I just want to remind you of uh, the glass doorknob that was on it. Before that, the doorknobs look like this. Now, the new doorknob we bought is actually black. And this is the finished bathroom door. The paint is a little different from this, uh, from in the hallway, but that's okay. I'll worry about that later. But I love the new knob and the plate, and I think the door looks much better than it did. No more bubbled paint.